Hey guys, welcome to a brand new episode of My DeFi Pet. Today we are talking about the differences between BSC and Cardia Chain and ultimately why I think people should switch to the Cardia Chain. We'll be going through that. So, uh, Binance Smart Chain and Cardia Chain, the game's down at the moment, they're upgrading it. Don't care how long it takes for them to, to go and upgrade the game, as long as it comes back without bugs. This past week has been so buggy, reloading pages, it crashing, so I, I just hope they focus on fixing it. It looks like they've got the groundwork of the breeding down now, that it was just all over the place. You could breed anything with anything, and it, it was coming out with sometimes with full gear and then sometimes with absolutely nothing. But they've put a, an article out on Medium, which I'm doing a video on, so make sure to look out for that. But today we're talking about the differences between BSC and Cardia Chain and why I think you should make the switch if you're on the BSC chain. Personally, I am on both. You're not meant to have dual accounts, but at the very start of the game, I bought loads of pets on Cardia Chain and loads of pets on Binance Smart Chain. And they didn't tell you that it was going to be on a separate game. And so you've got, what are you going to do with all those pets? Just just wait and do nothing with them? You're not going to be able to breed them? So I make the argument that it's okay to have two sites on Cardi BSC Chain with the, the, the intention fully to go into one if they create a bridge. I would happily transfer all my pets over to one side and just play one game if it was allowed. And I think that's going to come eventually, the way you're going to be able to trade in between. And at that point, I will just trade all my stuff over to probably the Cardia chain. Um, but for now, you can't. So <laughs> the transfer over to Cardia chain, if you're not on it, this is really for people who are new players. Because if you've already played on the Binance Smart Chain, you'll have all your animals currently on there. They'll be the ones that are farming good silver you have leveled up quite high but if you're new to this game i recommend starting off from the cardio chain first reason is price for pets so 3d pet is the price of one egg five pet d pet to evolve now the current price of d5 pet has really flown up the the past couple of days it's gone up 100 percent over the last seven days from what was 54 cents to one dollar zero four cents now this sometimes happens before a, a, a potential update and then they wait and then if the update is not great it will it'll tend to people will sell off um so we'll see what happens there so it's it costs one dollar zero four cents with um with with be it Binance smart chain on the cardia chain it is 19.11 for Kai, so DPET equals 19.11 Kai. Now Kai is currently priced at 0.045. It's gained about 10% in the past day, which is really good to see, um, which increases the price of it. 19.11 uh, times 0.045 equals 85 cents. So you can see that already comparing the DeFi, the DPET per dollar is cheaper on the cardio chain so if you're not sure how to transfer over to the cardio chain check out my video where um i post on how to do that switch how to take any currency fire pancake swap anything that you've got on your metamask trust wallet through um pancake swap through to kucoin over to the cardio chain um so it's already cheaper per dpet now 15 cents might not seem like a lot or 20 cents but if you're going to be buying like 100 pets which 100 pets is 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 probably a great starting amount of pets to have because you'll get some rares in there that's what you're really going to need for breeding uh, i think and then so times that by 0.2 you're saving 20 dollars compared to the DeFi chain now, that doesn't mean that it's going to stay the same when I've released this video, DPEC could have gone up 10% um, on the uh, on the Cardia chain. 20% would need to, to, to catch up with it. Um, but at the moment, it's cheaper, and it is you know it was around 16 to 17 yesterday. Second thing, why is it best to go to it is 
you are going to have a lot cheaper cheaper transaction fees so every time you purchase an egg you're going to have to pay um, your transaction fee for so if we go to Binance Smart Chain um, if we go to oh so you still can't actually purchase eggs whilst it's down uh, you would purchase eggs and it would cost 3 Leapet but then you have to pay a transaction fee now that transaction fee would be about 20 cents to 30 cents so already you know those 100 eggs which you, you're spending an extra 20 cent 20 dollars more you're now paying an extra 30 dollars in um in transaction fees compared to kai which you're going to spend probably 0 0.01 you're not probably going to even spend that one cents for all those transaction fees so you're saving 50 dollars if you buy 100 pets on the cardi chain versus the DeFi pet at current price next we do not have staking available yet in the game when that comes in it's going to be huge because we're going to be able to stake it for eggs and other stuff it seems now there's nothing on the Binance Not Smart Chain where you can stake DPET at the moment so if you're not purchasing eggs if you're holding DPET it's it's not earning anything for you unless you know it's earning only what it goes up or down by I mean it's just gone down to nine, 98 cents now you made a sale that's that same that same, same sale again 585 so you're just buying and selling is it the same one Zero XC fifty seven. No, it's a different different account. Um, nothing on the Binance Smart Chain, but on the Cardi Chain, there are now three options for staking back for staking um, DPAT. You can earn Beko through DPAT, staking it there. Now the APR on that is zero point two nine percent. Which is small, but it adds up. You know, if over the, over a week, you can get forty-five beko, forty beko per dollars, forty-five beko. Would equate to 0.029. I'm not sure if that equates. To, well, it would equate to twenty-nine, two point nine, two point nine, two point nine dollars, two point nine dollars for every thousand. And then 2% of that would be $20. So yeah, you're doing $20 at after seven days on every thousand. I've got about 4,000 in it. So it's $80, $80 at the end, of the end of the week. Now that relies on compounding. And the stats of it were higher. We've got DeFiley as another option. So if we go to their earning platform, not many farms, farms. We can stake deep at here. They offer 2.5% on the week, 0.336% return of interest daily, which is higher than that. But then we go for the highest one, which is brand new site, sleepearn.finance. Now this is an auto compounding, so you don't have to worry about harvesting and compounding it, harvesting and compounding, which is a way of increasing your returns. This does it automatically for you. So this you will need DPET Kai token, that, that token is tied to DPET Kai. And the value of that so you can transfer that into tokens and from that you'll gain 0.73 percent daily so almost twice as much as as pretty pretty much pretty much twice as much almost as the the highest one on defiley was it um no becca swap 0.39 yeah 0.36 would be 72 0.72 Oh, it is higher. <laughs> it's double. It's double. So you can already see that it's better to go on that. But that way, you're going to be earning $40 on every thousand. So at the end of the week, if that stays the same, which will likely go down slightly, um, I'll be looking at returns of 200 on my 4,000 DPET, which is way better than just letting it slip away, doing nothing. I don't know why they've got two of the same but on this one oh you can come out of that and then go into that for 0.79 it's because people have been putting liquidity into that but now if people put liquidity in that it'll go, yeah you might want to switch that um so yeah we can see that that's definitely the best option 
and you can be making earning because uh, you know it's something way better than nothing and you could just use those that, that 200 a month 200 dollars a week to buy some more packs with that you can do what you want with it um but that's why i think kai is definitely the way to go um and I think that is it for my arguments of why people should switch to the cardio chain in relation to those who are playing the game currently on the balanced smart chain you know I wouldn't advise switching over now because you've got this, the, the terms and conditions are that you can't have two accounts I don't understand that rule why, why would you let me buy pets on two separate accounts then on the Cardi chain and the Binance Smart chain. I don't know, but hopefully they'll merge at one point. I don't know how they're going to do that. Or you can just select one that you want to prioritize. <laughs> Anybody knows any information on that? Let me know. I'd be interested in the comment section below. Any questions you have about the game, let me know. I'll do my best to help you out with that. Apart from that, that is all for this one. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. If you have, please leave a like on the video. It always helps the channel out. Hit subscribe to keep up with every future content. That's all for me. See you guys soon.